You are now love. <laughs> okay. Hello, hello, welcome. <clears throat> Post. <laughs> We are here, we are live, wherever you are. I hope that you are feeling great and loved and seen and heard and recognized and cherished and appreciated and loved. And if you are not, just understand that you have the energy, the vibration, the love within to get all of that for yourself. It's all yours. It's already within. You are already worthy, already cherished, already honored, already appreciated because you do it for yourself. Mm. It's just so delicious and just so wonderful and I'm excited for you to build this relationship with self and I'm also very excited to just be a part of your life and whatever little drips and ways that I am and you mine the creativity that sparks in my life when you flutter into it for the moment that you are in it ah i'm so grateful for you i'm gonna choose some music for us Ooh, i love the idea of nature sounds in the background will it let me How are you feeling today on this earth? How on earth are you feeling? Thursday. it's muted I'm like how come I can't hear a thing at all <laughs> like a single thing here we are nature sounds I already had my walk this morning and it was absolutely magical and just beautiful and wonderful <laughs> all the foals it was full of it and oh I got a good stretch out there good balance I actually recorded some on TikTok but it did not allow me to save it all and so that mindful movement into the sun was for me in the sun <laughs> mm. so I was able to get my walk in hello welcome and just getting in nature in general that is a meditative state walking and allowing yourself to witness your thoughts without judgment 
without a call to action of what to do with such thoughts. Anything that you're able to do that is going to be so powerful for you. And then there's the sitting meditation, the kind that we practice here every day at noon. Well, every day I can, at least every weekday. <laughs> Just sitting with self, allowing yourself to pause in the middle of this day. Say you've been up since five o'clock, six, seven, eight, even 10. You get to take this moment with yourself for a moment and just be. Catch up with the first thought that led you out of your bed and to the next thought and to the next thought and to the next ones that you were not able to process or write down or feel into or just be. Now is a wonderful, beautiful time to just sit still and allow your feelings to happen. Allow your thoughts to happen. Mm, and you do love yourself, yes. Bring that self-love here. Invite a deep breath into your vessel, into your body. Mm, hold it at the top, just feel your rib cage expand, feel your chest. <sighs> And then let it out. Feel all of it leave. Breathe in that deep, fresh air of gratitude. And exhale anything that is not love, anything that is not blessing your life today. You get to release it right now. Shake it off. Mm. Mm. Keep breathing that gratitude and invite love into it. Feeling the words, I love myself. I love myself. breath now we take a moment to just pause allow whatever thoughts to come up without judgment without control mm. Inhale. Be still. Sorry about that.
go ahead and welcome in a deep breath. I'm not sure how long it was paused. Oh my goodness. Let's talk about the breath. During meditation, whenever you do feel your thoughts, <laughs> your thoughts going to something else, your thoughts leaving where you are right now. You can always come back to the breath. Come back to the rhythm that your breath, your body has chosen. You may find that you've been holding your breath that possibly once the breath has gone down, you kind of sit in the breath for a while. And then you'll be watching your thoughts, still sunken, still sunken, and then realize you're watching your thoughts, realize that your breath has stopped, that your breath has paused. And then invite that breath back into your body. With that breath of air rushing through your lungs, through your body, sending oxygen to your blood, whatever you were thinking of, whatever thoughts were repeating or ruminating, they dissipate. And the next exhale is you mindfully allowing it to dissipate. Ah. And go back to being the observer of your thoughts in that moment. Using the breath as your tether back to self. With the reminder that the, each breath into this body is a blessing. Mm. And with radical gratitude, you exist on that blessing alone. Thank you, breath. Mm. Thank yourself for pausing in this moment, for feeling into your body, into yourself for this moment. Amazing. You are so amazing. To love yourself this much. Hmm. Yes, this is for me. Mm. Breathe that gratitude into your body. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. Mm 
there are any feelings that arise during this time, allow them to happen. Allow the feelings to just be. What a blessing for yourself. We're getting longer and longer in our increments. First you start off with maybe three minutes a day. Maybe next time you do five minutes a day. Seven minutes. You're up to 10 minutes of meditating a day. And soon you're taking time for 30 minutes. You're setting aside time for an hour of just sitting with yourself and seeing what is being delivered. Taking note in the different feelings all over your body. Oh, I got a paper cut there the other day. I forgot about that. Or, oh, I... I feel something in my back. Maybe I should do a little more um, ab workouts so that I can align my back with some kind of support and muscle. Just sitting there and then your brain gives you that and you're like, oh, <laughs> okay. Add some ab workouts, got it. <laughs> and then... I mean, that's just, that's just how it is. I mean, you're gonna be sitting there and you're gonna be getting all of these different notes, these different calls. If you stop the messages, if you stop it to ponder one and take one apart, then you're keeping yourself from whatever other messages that can come to you through meditation. And so during this sacred time with yourself, you may wanna have a journal next to you or just a pen and piece of paper to write something down. Um, once you think of it, if you think you're gonna forget, but other than that, I would really just push you to just sit and be and allow all everything just to come, just to let you know how it's going without your, your humanness kind of stepping in and being like, I know what this is about, I know this, I gotta do this, I know this. Allow, allow all of it to just be for a moment without you getting involved. <laughs> 
And that's one of the just most powerful ways you're gonna get to know yourself is this action right here. This. My voices. My messages told me to share, to share it. It's like, cool, you're meditating on your own. You're here to share. You're here to show up for the community and show them that it's possible and that you can pause in the middle of your day and have time for yourself. I mean, I'll be talking about just being me in public and they're just like, there's no time for it. There's no time. Like, there's time. You make time for everything you want, everything you desire. If you know that by meditating, you become a better business person because you're more grounded in the decisions that you are making going forward, then you're going to take that minute to ground yourself and meditate in the middle of the day every day. If you know that as a healer, you are a better vessel for the messages if you meditate first but you've allowed the the masculinity and capitalism rush you to your practices and rush you to show up to appointments and sessions in a rush and not having grounded your energy for the person that needs you or needs your message then and you're aware that meditation and just sitting still is what is going to keep you at your highest and clearest as a vessel, you're going to take that time to sit with self and make sure that you are of your most highest, that you can be that day of yourself. <sighs> so... Just showing up for yourself is number one. Loving yourself enough to show up for yourself is number one. For me now, it's showing up for others. Showing up for self and showing up for others. Showing it for you. physically, mentally, spiritually, what are your ancestors saying? That's the next level. You start getting messages from your ancestors. You start getting messages from the universe when you're closer to yourself. So just sit and listen. See what the message is for you today.
return to your breath. You get stuck on a thought. Come back to you. So much love, gratitude to you. Honor yourself every single day with this pause, with this moment with self. You are worthy. You are inherently worthy just by showing up to the spaces that you do. By waking up and choosing the choices that you do. You are so worthy. Just so everything. I'm so proud of you. And you are so proud of you. Oh my goodness, thank you for bringing myself back to me. I have enjoyed this. See you next time. That's so sweet. <laughs> it is an absolute honor. That is what I'm here for. To help bring people back to themselves. Back to their souls. Back to who they are. Back to who they are meant to be who they intend to be by being my authentic self and showing up as me I get to inspire others to be who they be I'm sending so much love to you so much power to you so much healing to you and so much light to you may you find the light within, the darkness within that continues to sprout you into who you are, you beautiful soul, you powerful being, mm. love yourself, I love you. <laughs>